January five. I want to know. How then can they call on the one they have not believed in? And how can they believe in the one of whom they have not heard? And how can they hear without someone preaching to them? And how can anyone preach unless they are sent? As it is written, how beautiful are the feet of those who bring good news. Romans chapter 10 verses 14 and 15 New International Version My husband and I were concluding the process for the sale of our home with our real estate agent. We just signed the papers and taken a deep breath. What do you do? Lori asked me out of the blue. I'm what our denomination calls a Bible worker, I said. What's a Bible worker and what do you do? She asked. Though I'm just about to retire, I study the Bible with people who are interested in knowing more about it and I want to know more about the Bible. She interjected unexpectedly. I blinked. Rarely has an interest just dropped into my lap like that. I became a Christian as a teenager, she went on, but I've never understood very much. I didn't grow up in a Christian home, and I haven't had anyone to explain things to me. I've been praying that someone would appear who could. I blink again. The Lord was absolutely present and active in that room at that moment. His presence could be felt, seen, heard. As I made Bible study arrangement for Laurie with my replacement, I thought of the wonderful sequence God put into place. It includes us mere mortals so that others might find Jesus. Someone is positioned to be the conduit. That person acts when the opportunity presents the provided for individual hears, believes, and accepts the relationship. And then the riches of the universe are open to them. Forgiveness, reconciliation, and salvation are all available. The process repeats itself again and again with each of us privileged to play our part. We can, if we choose, and we must so choose if we wish to remain in relationship ourselves, play a part in this grand design. It is one of the provisions made for our own salvation. So let's choose to play our part. There are many lorries out there. You never know when the Lord might place one right in your lap. For sure, you want to be ready. Carolyn K. Carl Strong